have finally made the neon gingerbread reindeer. But before we trade this neon gingerbread reindeer, if you want your own mega neon pet, leave a like on the video, hit the subscribe button, and comment down your Roblox username. Also, don't forget, use star code FISHY when buying Robux. All right, guys, so we have the neon gingerbread reindeer, and it looks pretty cool. So if you guys haven't seen it yet, basically, the neon parts of this is the antlers and the scarf thing. I think it's a scarf. I'm not too sure, but it basically just lights up, which looks really cool in my opinion. So I hope I can get some good trades for this. Not expecting too much it is a free item. So I feel like maybe I'm not going to get the best trades. All right. So we're in the neon cave. It's a rich server. Let's see what we can find in here. I see a mega lava wolf. I see a few frost dragons. I do see another neon reindeer and a mega neon gingerbread reindeer. So I don't know if I'm going to get the best trades here. So I just hope I can get something good. I'm not expecting too much. The server looks really rich as well. I see a neon bat dragon. I see an owl. There's so many cool pets here. So I feel like I'm not going to get good offers. I feel like the server is way too rich. All right. So we have the first trade and I don't think that's real. I don't think this is worth a tombstone. So I'm going to decline. I feel like they're going to ask me to offer or if it's an offer, I feel like that's too much of an overpay. So I am going to decline just so I can see what else I can get. I do think that's a good item though. I love the tombstones. I think they are amazing. And the second offer is actually pretty good. I think it's kind of a fair trade or an even trade. We have the neon fly ride unicorn and the neon ride B. They also hit accept, but I just started trading. So I don't think I'm going to do the first trade I got. So we're going to continue trading to see what else we can get. I want to see what the value of this is. So far, I've gotten the neon unicorn and something else and the neon bee. I wonder if I'll get anything better. I don't think I will. I see so many of these neon gingerbread reindeers already. There's a double aging going on. There's also free items. So I don't see the value of this being way too high. But for this trend, we have cat wow with a ride gingerbread, a ride red panda, the metal ox, a gingerbread reindeer, not bad, the bee, the badger, the evil basilisk, the pomeranian, and the spider crab. So it's not too bad. I like the offer. It's pretty decent. I still prefer the neon unicorn offer with the neon B. So I think I'm going to have to pass on this one because I think I'm going to go for that offer if I don't get anything better. I'm going to tell them I'll think about the offer just because it's only the second offer I've gotten that's actually real. So I don't really know what it's worth. All right. So we have the next trade. Now we have a neon fly ride snow owl, a neon fly ride king B. Okay. Pretty cool offer. I think this might be a little bit better than the Neon Unicorn offer. They also hit accept. I'm going to tell them I'll think about this one. So far, this offer by Debolito is in the lead. The Neon Fly Ride Snow Owl and the Neon Fly Ride King Bee. Really, really nice offer. I want your opinion though. What offer do you think is the best so far? I'm not getting the best offers. I think the server is a little bit too rich where people just have way too many good pets and they don't know how to offer for something like lower tier. I feel like this is not worth a lot right now. So I'm going to take one more trade. And if it's not a real offer, I think I'm going to switch servers to see what else I can find. I might try and find something that's not extremely rich. All right. So for this offer, we have a Neon Queen B. Okay. I take it back. I think this is my best offer so far. Neon Queen B. I'm going to think about this one, but I do think I have to switch servers to see if I can find anything else where I can get better offers for this. All right. So I just told them I'll think about it. I'm going to decline now and hopefully we can find another rich server. All right. So I switched and this one looked a little bit better. It's not too rich. It looks pretty decent. There's a lot of cool pets, but nothing too crazy like neon bat dragons or mega shadows. Just looks like a decent rich server. I see neon turtles. I see pandas. I see other neon pets. So maybe I can get a good trade here. All right. So we have the first offer in the new server. We have a Cerberus fly and ride a ride Cobra ride dragon. Ride Ice Moth Dragon, Ride Kitsune, Ride Lava Dragon, Ride Gingerbread Reindeer, Ride Snowball Pet, and a Fly and Pet Potion. All right, so I told them I'll think about the offer. So far, this has to be the best offer so far. Just with the Lava Dragon, I think that's a crazy offer already. So if I take anything, it's either this offer or it's the Neon Queen Bee offer, in my opinion. I think those are just way too good. I know there's a few other offers that are pretty decent as well, but I don't know. For me, those are my top two favorite. Comment down below which ones you guys like, and maybe I'll take one of those. Who knows? But for this offer, we have a Fly Ride Swan. That's pretty cool. I like the old pets. They hit accept already and then unaccepted, so I think that's their only offer. It's pretty cool. I think the swans are amazing, but I have a hard time trading those, so I think I'm going to have to pass on that. And let's see what else we can get. All right, so we have dog to neon giraffe one, two, three. Okay, that's a nice challenge. But we have the mega Wolpertinger. Oh, they removed it. They put the neon Armine. 
the Neon Flyride King B, and they added the Whooper Tinker back, Mega Ride. So it's a pretty cool offer. Once again, I love it, but I don't know if I'm able to do this one. I want to see what else I can get. I told them I'm thinking about it. I think it's a good offer. I do like the Mega Whooper Tinker. The Neon Queen B or King B, I mean, is really cool as well. But I think I'm convinced on taking the Neon Queen B or the last pet we just got. So I don't know. The offers have been amazing. Nothing convincing yet. Just a lot of really cool offers. Nothing that has made me accept or want to accept right away. It's not the rarest pet. It's super easy to get. Or I think it was only available for one day. So maybe it's not super easy to get anymore. But it was super easy to make since there's double aging. Alright, they put the Corgi. I don't think I would want a Corgi. I think I'm going to have to pass on this one. The Corgi is a cool pet. It looks amazing. But it's not something I would want right now. Especially with some of the other offers I've received. Alright, so we have... Ooh, some Fly Pet Potions. Not bad. Ooh, are they going to put nine? That would be a pretty cool offer. Oh, then ride potions, the last two. I don't know. I kind of like the offer. Fly a pet potions are really cool in my opinion. I don't know if I'm going to take it, but that's a really cool offer. I know there was a sale recently. Oh, it's still going on. So there is a sale on fly a pet potions. I think there's still like 200 Robux, which is still pretty crazy when you think about it. That's like a thousand Robux right there in potions. All right, so we have the next trade though. So we have the fly ride gold horn. Okay, pretty cool offer. We love the gold horn. It's a legendary pet from the Mythic Egg. Oh, Snowball Fight. No, thank you. So I don't think I'll take a single one since we've been offered a few Neon legendary pets. So I'm going to have to pass on this. I do think it's a cool looking pet though. Let the trades continue. Let's see what else we can get. Oh, a Neon Monkey. That's a cool pet. And I think it's a fair trade. A Neon Slug. A Ride of Pet Potion. So two Neon pets. One of my favorite pets is the Monkey. So I don't know. I like the offer so far. They even added the Tan Chow Chow, which I'm pretty sure is Robux, and then another Gingerbread Reindeer. Another tempting offer. We are going to keep on trading to see what else we can get, but I don't know, guys. I feel like I should accept an offer now. I feel like the more time passes, the least rare this becomes. I feel like it doesn't have much value anymore. So I feel like eventually I will have to decide what I'm going to get for it. We have another Goldhorn, but they added the Axolotl. They added the Zodiac Minion Check and removed it. So I think it's just these two pets. And the Shiba Inu, two Shiba Inus. Anything else? I don't think they are going to add anything else. So, I think I'm going to pass on it. I might have made up my mind to what I want. So, I guess we'll just wait and see. All right. So, I was going to keep on trading the Neon. But I already have the Mega. And I'd rather trade that. So, I've decided I'm going to give this away. Plus, I'm going to give away whatever I hatch from this Aussie egg. So, let's go ahead and open it up. If you guys want to win whatever's inside this Aussie egg after a hatchet and the Neon Reindeer, just comment down your Roblox username, leave a like in the video, and hit the subscribe button. And here we go. This is the second prize for whoever gets chosen. They also win. No, this is Dingo, but I'm going to sign it. I'm going to call it Dingo from Fishy. I don't know if it makes it any more special, but there we go. 